It has become known that the Russian army was powerless against storm shadow missiles. The Nova Sherkask, a large landing ship from the Russian Black Sea Fleet, has been destroyed near Feodosia by cruise missiles from tactical aircraft belonging to Ukraine's Air Force. Yuri Inat, spokesman for the Ukrainian Air Force, said this in an interview with Radio Liberty targeted with cruise missiles. What's there to specify? We don't have many of these weapons in our arsenal and they were provided to us by our partners. Currently, people will be asking by which missile specifically, ours or our partners, because every manufacturer wants to showcase such results of their work. It's like advertising their achievements. We have Storm Shadow and Scalp in our arsenal, Inat added. He added that to destroy such a ship, it was necessary to launch clearly not just one missile because the enemy can intercept cruise missiles. Inat also said that the significant explosion observed on the Russian ship indicates that it was not a minor detonation of something there, but rather a detonation of ammunition because a large landing ship is used to transport equipment, weapons and personnel. Inat also refuted Russian claims about the alleged downing of two Ukrainian Su-24s, adding that Russians have even been destroying F-16s in their reports for a long time. As is known, Ukraine has not yet acquired these fighter jets. Neither Russia nor Ukraine identified the weaponry used in the night strike, but some military experts believe that they were the Storm Shadow air-to-surface cruise missiles which the UK provided to Kiev earlier this year. The same type of weapon was reportedly deployed during the September attack on a military dock in Sevastopol in which the Kilo-class diesel-electric attack submarine Rostov-on-Don and the Rapucha-class landing ship Minsk were hit.